Let's take a look at the control center. If you swipe down from the upper right hand corner, you'll see that it brings up a couple of different features and functionalities. You have your camera, you have a timer, you can control text size if you want to there. Also, you can lock the rotation of your iPad, which I highly recommend when you're doing presentations. You can also stop notifications by hitting the little moon there. The biggest feature that you'll use inside of Control Center will be screen mirroring. Because when you use screen mirroring, this is how you will access your Apple TV. What if there are some features in the Control Center that you don't see, but you'd like to have access to? Well, let's go to Settings and Customize. So inside Settings, you'll see under the General tab, if I hit Control Center, and then right here you'll see Customize Controls. If I customize controls, I can then add anything that I'd like that's down below here. A couple of the things that I'd highly recommend adding would be the Apple TV remote because you guys will be receiving your Apple TVs. And that's a little bit about your control center. We'll go over these a little bit more in detail later on.